up, guys? Welcome to Holly Scoops Daily Rewind. I'm Madison Hill. And I'm Courtney Revolution. It is Friday, and we're ending the week with the tea that you need. We're talking the latest. My voice just cracked like I'm a prepubescent oh. boy there. Whoa, I don't know what that was. Uh, we're talking the latest with Kylie Jenner and Drake. Selena Gomez standing at the Frozen 2 premiere. Yes, and Tyga potentially shooting his shot. Swish, swish. At Halsey, I can't believe I just quoted a Katy Perry song. Yeah, murder me now. Another one in the basket, girl. Yes. Okay. So first, though, let's get to, into some tea about Justin Bieber. Um, Justin might want to worry about getting himself into a little trouble with the constant support he's showing Logan Paul because oh. now. KSI, which you guys know, Logan Paul and KSI are gearing up to fight once again. Uh, but now KSI has spoken to TMZ and said that after he fights Logan this next time around, he wants to get in the ring with Justin Bieber. Uh -uh. Uh, he said he doesn't know what weight Justin can get up to, but he thinks it's a natural fight. No. KSI, Jeff Cross. how about an I, I, I and go to bed? <laughs> I don't think that there should be any more celebrity, well, KSI's not a celebrity to me, but I don't think that there should be any more like, boxing matches. Boxing matches well, between celebrities. I feel like Justin Bieber tried to do it with Tom Cruise. And then remember we heard like all of these things like, yeah. yes, the people of the UFC are on board, they want to make it happen. And then somehow Justin Bieber was like, just kidding, just kidding, just kidding. his way on out of so, it. So I feel like Justin Bieber likes to talk about fighting and he probably is a fan of boxing, but he doesn't want to actually get in the ring himself. Well, you gotta think, you gotta train for that. You have to take mm -hmm. time off. Is Justin mentally ready to take on a commitment like that? Also, remember Logan Paul said, we talked about this earlier on the morning tea, you gotta take your vow of uh, your oh, self-imposed yeah. sex ban. Building your batch. Yeah, build. Oh, that really, right. Ugh, I feel sorry. like that's the kind of voice you gotta use when you say building oh, the batch, bro. I, I wanted a gag just thinking about that. Oh, <laughs> so gross. We're building I don't the know. batch. Justin Bieber literally went to the courthouse, so he wouldn't have to build the batch. So I don't know if he would be down for it. <laughs> oh, um, but KSI told TMZ he is certain he could beat Justin Bieber, and his promoter said that there is actually a good chance that they could try to make this happen because ultimately it comes down to money. And a fight between KSI and Justin Bieber would bring in a lot of funds. I still don't think Justin would do it. Um, I, I think, think KSI should wait. Yeah. Until the album's out. I agree. And then I also it. just feel like I feel like Justin's just kind of invested in the Logan Paul thing because he likes YouTubers, he likes mm -hmm. creators. Like, I don't think he actually wants to get involved himself. He Could just likes imagine? to post on Instagram. Could you imagine that? Are you gonna pay money for that? Mm, probably not. No. Nope. Probably not. No. Nope. And I ain't gonna show up either. The Justin Bieber Tom Cruise, <laughs> I could maybe be convinced. But Justin Bieber KSI, you guys know how I feel about that. Don't even no. know KSI. No. Right? No. No. Okay, let's move on and talk about Selena Gomez because she stunned at the Frozen 2 premiere and she brought her little sister as her plus one, which I thought was absolutely adorable. So cute. Uh, they stole the carpet in their matching Marc Jacobs dresses mm -hmm. and they had like these like capes. Like a little feather. Kind yeah. of, it was like a big kind of like couture mode. It was like a like. couture take on Frozen. Yes. You know what I mean? Yeah. You know Disney bounding? You know people Disney bound? Of yes. course. It was kind of like Madison. that, but like yes. a, a designer version. Um, all of the Selenators on Twitter were absolutely losing it over all of the sweet sister moments they had on the carpet. They got to meet Anna and Elsa, and they just had like a little smooch, and like Selena just looked very caring. She looked happy and peaceful. Yes, that's true. Yeah. That is true. Um, the word queen was thrown around quite a bit amongst the reactions. So Justin Bieber, you guys know he loves to be on his Instagram story. Of course. He went ahead and posted who his queen is. Uh, he posted a side by side of him and Haley and said, this is my queen. We did not ask. <laughs> also, <laughs> we already know. We I, know. I feel Y'all like got married. We saw the photo. Right before they had the wedding ceremony, I feel like we take full responsibility. Mm. We were on Justin, like, post about your wife, post about your wife. She's always posting about you. Absolutely. But now I feel like he's almost doing it. He's responding too much that exactly. I'm like, why are you fighting back so much? It doesn't feel genuine to me. Right. Like, if he were just to do it while Selena is not doing anything at all, I would be like, oh, okay, mm -hmm. showing love to your wifey, right? right. But when, it's always like when Selena does something that it's in response. It appears yeah. to be in response to something that she does. That's what I don't like. And even if you guys want to say Justin Bieber doesn't care about Selena, I think that's totally fine. However, then I think someone on his PR team needs to tell him, hey, log off, don't post, SOS, Selena is out because honestly the timing's just too convenient to ignore it mm. and say there's absolutely no connection between the two. Like I think saying that is a bit naive. Personally. I agree. Um, okay, let's move on and talk about Tyga and Halsey, you guys. Tyga. Um, Tyga. 
Actually, that kind of doesn't sound that bad. It's not a ship that's currently active. But no, like, but I just like mashing people's names but together. But it could be. Yeah. It could be. Uh, so you guys, Tyga recently commented on Halsey's Instagram post um, from when she was in London visiting the BBC Radio studio. And she does look awesome. She did. I mean, the abs were out. Mm. She was looking good. She had her baby hairs. Lit Madison. I was surprised. I didn't want to be extra during the tea, but I, I definitely wanted to be like, did you see her chili TLC baby You didn't hair? even comment. I was like. I was trying to leave it. I was like, are you going to say anything about the all that? The baby hair, that was giving me life. I ain't going to lie. They were good. The toothbrush, the detail. <laughs> Better than Kylie Jenner's on the Kylie skin kit that we got. <laughs> Madison. I always bring that up because you had a real issue with that. She tried it. I know. She tried it. I know she Kylie, did. You, you, you tried it. And Halsey, <laughs> Halsey came out on top of this she one, I've got to say. Uh, and Tyga definitely recognized it. He commented, drip, mm. with the flame emojis. Um, so now the question is, how do we interpret this? Is he shooting a shot? We know Halsey is dating Evan Peters from Absolutely. American Horror Story. She's confirmed it on Ellen. but. That's never stopped people before. Most, of, uh, most of the time, people don't care. Is he just sending a compliment, or are we gonna get a collab? Out I'm of like, it? if there's a collab, is it called Drip? Drip, drip, drip. I, mean, I wouldn't be mad about it. Drip with be, two peas. But I feel like we already have the drip song. Like, That's came through dripping. That's. I know it's not called Drip, but I'm just saying. I feel like. Oh, the cup. Yeah, I'm just saying that I'm might. Be, that. I know, but I'm just saying that would be maybe too close. Madison, that's not too close. Drip with two peas and whatever the other song is, I literally not even being shady. Should, I literally don't remember. They the should name do of the something. Song. Neither do I, but I just know that came through dripping, drip, drip. Tigers will be better. <laughs> it will. Tiger I mean, Halsey will kill that. We have taste as just a predecessor of what that could be. Also, I do like the drip with two peas because that could easily go with thick with two C's. I would like I'm it. sure Tiger would rhyme. Right? You know, yeah. like I can already Make imagine it. Thick, it. Thick. I can he I can hear it, Madison. And then can you just see me in my car? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yes, the yes. two C's. Because you want the two C's. When you start bordering the CK, that's when I'm like, Madison, get it together. I'll get on the treadmill. You're, silly. You're bordering the bordering the line. You don't want that. Okay, now let's talk about Kylie and Drake, you guys. So a source told Hollywood Life that Kylie is not looking to commit to Drake right now or label their relationship. Of course not. I know. The source said she thinks Drake is funny, attractive, and she likes having him around, but she's not ready for a title. However, on the flip side, uh, a title could still be coming in the future because a separate source told E! News that Kylie is very comfortable with Drake and, quote, it may turn into something more than friends. Uh, this source went on to say that Kylie is exploring things. <clears throat> and happy to be seeing him. Ultimately, though, she considers herself to be single. Explore she is exploring that man. I know her, she her, is. Her idol. I know she is. Someone that she used to look up to as a child. Had a crush on as a child. Had a crush on as a child. That was something from yesterday, if you guys missed it. This was a source speaking to In Touch Weekly, and mm. they were saying that Kylie has had a crush on Drake since she was a kid, and the timing wasn't right until now the timing's right. Like, were you watching Degrassi? Right? Were I don't you know. a gymnast fan? I think she might have been. <laughs> because Drake has been around the family for a long time. Yeah. We've heard that every single report. Drake's been a friend of the family for forever, blah, blah, blah. I just am like, I understand she doesn't want a title because I don't think she wants it to reflect negatively on her to be like she went mm -hmm. from one, one relationship to the next. But I'm getting a sense that that's kind of Kylie's thing. Like she doesn't strike me as the independent single boss babe that we like want her to be. I think she's definitely a smart businesswoman and she's a boss babe in that respect. But she likes being in a relationship. I think that Kylie will stay single mm -hmm. technically until right after Valentine's Day. Interesting. I really truly think so because it would be crazy of her to not capitalize off of her and Travis splitting and, and not come a, out with a collection. A single girl collection or yeah, something like that. I really think that that's if she's not planning that, Kylie, you have time. You're rich. That's what she should be doing. But do, so do we think like her and Drake are friends with benefits because I will I say. I think he's the side chick. Yeah, I do. I wouldn't be surprised if her and Travis are still together. To Interesting. Be I definitely think like they're for sure hooking up. There's mm. no way you can tell me that Drake is spending all this time at her house and they're Travis hanging out and they're enjoying. No, Travis isn't there. Tra mm. His patel is healed. He's not there anymore. <laughs> but I'm just saying, I feel like they definitely have to be hooking up. I, that I believe. Yeah. For sure. But I definitely do She's think She's definitely that exploring. Drake is in the wings. He's not the main girl. You think Travis is still the main girl? I think Travis could still be the main girl. I think after Valentine's Day, a source came out and they were able to reconcile on Valentine's Day night <laughs> after we done took your $50 for the palette that just came out. <laughs> and we gonna look stupid February 15th. I, I wouldn't that, be surprised. I hope that's not the case, but honestly, Lord only knows, but still, that gives 
plenty, plenty of time for more drama to mm -hmm. unfold, which you already know that it's going to. Uh, but you guys, now it's time to let us know what you're thinking. What was your reaction to KSI wanting to fight Justin Bieber? And I don't know why I went British there. Bieber. KSI is British, so honestly, that wasn't too far off. You uh, and Selena taking her sister to the Frozen 2 premiere. What are your thoughts on Tyga's comment on Halsey's Instagram? Is he flirting, just being nice, or is he trying to get a collab? Yes, drip thick. Let's make it happen. Last but not least, what do you guys think? Kylie and Drake have in store for the future. Let it out down below. Don't forget to tune in to Moments of the Week tomorrow, the morning tea on Monday, 8.30 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. In the meantime, shop the Holly Scoop store, subscribe, and click the bell. We'll see you next time. Bye, Bye guys. guys.